Hello, I'm Scott Flowers from Cloud Ninjas, and today we're here to talk about Dell PowerEdge R720 server memory. For starters, the R720 is the 2U older brother to the R620. So if you're familiar with the R620, you're in really good shape because it takes the exact same type, type of RAM. So the R720 has 24 DIMM slots, and it takes two types of RAM. ECC registered, also known as an RDIMM, or load reduced server memory, also known as an LRDIMM. There's advantages to the LRDIM because you can actually have a higher capacity. So with ECC Reg, you can max out at a total of 512 gigabytes via 16 slots filled with 32 gigabytes at 16, 1600 megahertz. With LRDIM, you can get 768 gigabytes and load up all 24 slots at 1866 megahertz. So why is it like this and why can you load up more capacity with LRDIM over RDIM? It's actually really simple. It's known as the rank rule. We talked about there's 24 slots. Well, if we do some quick math with 24 slots, that means there are three DIMMs per memory channel. And the rank rule states you can only have eight ranks per memory channel. So that means all, uh, all 32 gigs are quad rank. So as soon as you start loading them in, you'll quickly do some math and realize that when you put three DIMMs in, you're at 12 ranks. That breaks the rank rule with ECC registered and will render the machine useless and you cannot, cannot load it to start throwing errors. With uh, ECC Reg, you can get 16 DIMMs and leave the third slot empty. Now with load reduced, it breaks the rank rule and you can load it completely up and use all 24 slots and have a higher scalability. So we actually recommend LR DIMMs if you're looking to max out the system over ECC register. Now let's open her up and let's actually look at them so you can get a nice view inside the system. Before you open it up, make sure you grab your ESD gear. Now that we have our ESD gear on, we are safe to open the system and prevent it from being shocked. So it's really simple. Make sure that the system is not locked. Unlatch it and pop open the top. Once we are in, you will notice that the air baffle is covering up all the RAM. You will need to pull these tabs and remove the air baffle. Once the air baffle is removed, you are in and you can freely move the uh, modules and upgrade as needed. You will notice for this system that there are actually only four DIMMs in right now. So what we recommend is putting in these blanks into each slot. It actually protects the slots from getting shocked or potentially going bad in the future when not being run. And because of this, you can also notice the importance of the colors of these uh, of the slots. Each DIMM slot has a different color for the channel. So the start of the channel is the white DIMM slot, followed by black and green. With the white DIMM slot being the start of the channel, when you don't fully load the system with 24 slots, you need to make sure that you put a DIMM in the white slot. And you will notice that that is exactly how this is configured, two DIMMs in each of the white slots. Otherwise, it again will throw errors. Uh, the RAM is very easy to, to pop open. Uh, you literally just need to click on the tab. A little tight squeeze back here. I'm actually going to go ahead and remove the fans. It'll make it easier to get to the actual modules. There we go. Much easier. So now you just pop open the tab and you can simply just remove the module. Once the module is removed, you can upgrade it to an easier or to a higher capacity module. Now you will notice there is a notch or a key on the middle of the module. Uh, this is important if you are trying to load in, let's just say, a uh, desktop module. The notch or the key would actually be in the middle and would not physically fit into the server. So let's say this was a new module that we were putting in and we were upgrading. It's very simple you simply just put it back in and you click on the tabs and voila we're all set to go and we've put in our new module now if you guys are looking to upgrade your system um, please call us 
Uh, we have a ton of modules in stock. We have everything under the sun, ECC registered, load reduced, all the way up to 32 gigs. Have great deals on 8, 8 and 16 gigs as well. Well, thanks for stopping by to learn about the Dell PowerEdge R720. Have a nice day.